Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you guys how to make some delicious Mexican stuffed bell peppers. In case you guys want to make this super easy and delicious recipe, just stay tuned and I'll show you how. Alrighty guys, so let's get started with our ingredients. So for the recipe we're going to need one pound and a half of lean ground beef, one cup and a half of white rice, bell peppers, your favorite melting cheese, one small white onion chopped, two Roma tomatoes chopped, one cup of your favorite hot salsa, two cups of chicken broth, chopped cilantro, four minced garlic cloves, and all of our spices that I will link in the description box. So these are ingredients, now let's get started. Alrighty guys, so first we're going to start by preheating our oven to 350 degrees. Alright, so once we got that, we're going to start by cleaning out our bell peppers. So we're just going to cut the crown, and then just remove the insides. And of course, just make sure that you wash your bell peppers. And then just wiggle to remove the seeds. Okay, so just like that. And we're just going to do that to all of our bell peppers. All right, so once we have removed all the crowns to our bell peppers, now we're going to finally chop the leftovers. All right, so once we have our bell pepper all nice and chopped, we're going to set it to the side. All right, so now we're just going to season our bell peppers with a little bit of salt. All right, so once we have our bell peppers ready, now we are ready to begin cooking. All right, so now we're going to grab our large pan. We're going to set it on medium heat and we're going to add a little bit of oil. All right, so once our oil is hot, we're going to throw in our bell pepper and onion. And now we're going to fry them for three minutes. All right, so after three minutes, we're going to throw in our tomatoes, along with our minced garlic. And now we're going to fry them for a couple minutes. After a couple minutes, we're going to throw in our meat. We're going to add all of our seasonings. We're going to break down our meat. And now we're just going to brown our meat. All right, so once our meat has browned, we're going to throw in our rice. We're going to mix it all together. And we're going to let that cook for about three minutes. All right, so after three minutes, we're going to add our chicken broth. Along with our salsa. Going to mix it all together. And now we're just going to allow it to simmer. All right, so once it comes to a simmer, we're going to reduce the heat to the lowest setting. We're going to sprinkle our chopped cilantro. We're going to cover it and let that cook for 20 minutes. All right, so at this point, we're also going to put in our bell peppers in the oven. And we're going to let them bake for 20 minutes. All right guys, so it's been 20 minutes, so at this point, our beef mixture is done. So this is what it should look like. As you can see, all of the juice has been absorbed. So we're just going to close it and let that sit for a couple minutes before we transfer into our bell peppers. So we're also going to get our bell peppers out of the oven. Nice and soft. Okay, so we All right guys, so once we're ready to stuff our bell peppers, we're going to grab our bell pepper. And I have a half a cup here. I'm going to stuff my bell pepper. And then I'm going to add some shredded Oaxaca. So that's our Oaxaca queso. And now we're going to grab some more of our mixture. And then I'm going to top it with sliced queso Oaxaca. 
just like that. Okay, now we're just going to repeat the same process to all of our bell peppers. All right, so once we have our bell peppers all nice and stuffed, now we're going to throw them back in the oven. And we're going to bake them for about 10 minutes or until the cheese has melted. All right, you guys, so after 10 minutes, our bell peppers are done. All right, and now we're ready for the fun part. All right, you guys, and now for the fun part, serving. So, of course, you guys, this is how I like to enjoy my bell peppers. Um, you can just enjoy them just like that by itself. But I'm going to add a little bit more of the salsa. I'm going to grab my bell pepper, use it on top. And I like to enjoy it with some chips. So my chips on the side. I'm going to add some green onion and cilantro on top, just like that. And some sour cream. Okay, of course, some lime on the side. And now we are ready to enjoy our delicious Mexican stuffed bell pepper. Alrighty guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Now you can also add corn and beans to your mixture, but for me, this is just fine and I enjoy it so much like this. So hope you give it a try and now enjoy. Mm. Mm-hmm. Seriously, the best, so flavorful. Everything is just perfect. Mm -hmm. Hope you enjoy it just as much as I do. Alrighty guys, and there you have it, how I make some delicious Mexican stuffed bell peppers. I hope you guys had enjoyed watching this video, and if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and if you create this recipe, please don't forget to tag me in any of my social medias, and if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video.